This short DVD will describe two projects funded by the Alcohol Diversion Fund. The first is based in the Regal Theatre in Bathgate. Musicians provide tuition and a wide range of instruments in an informal setting. It's open to any young person from Bathgate and Boghall area, ages 12 to 18. My name is Ross Owen. Okay, and how old are you? 16. And where did you come from? <laughs> uh, Armadale. Okay. And what instrument do you have? Guitar. Guitar. And how long have you been coming to the club? About a year and a month. Okay. Is that from when we first started? Uh, I'm not sure. I think it's around about when it first started. And um, since you started coming here, uh, what have you learned? Learned about lots of different uh, things I can use for other instruments as well as just guitar, like keys and stuff, and just be basically improved everything in at guitar. Like your playing. Yeah. My finger picking and stuff like that. Cool. Rachel Baxter. And how old are you? Sixteen. Where are you from? What instrument? Guitar. And how long have you been coming to the club? About a year. And um, since coming to the club, what have you learned? How to play chords and how to play my favourite songs and techniques. Can you tell me your name? Uh, Byron. And um, how old are you? Twelve. And um, what area are you from? Uh, Bathgate. And um, what instruments do you play? Uh, guitar and bass. Cool. And um, how long have you been coming to the uh, club? About a year. Yeah. Um, what do you think you've learned since you started? Uh, well, more than I had, because when I started, I uh, knew about one chord. Now I know more. Played a talent show in front of my school, which was in front of like between 200 and 500, no, 400, 500 people in the space of one day, which was quite uh, nerve wracking, but it was so fun. It was the funnest thing ever. It's fun. Okay. And it's free, so I don't need to pay any money because I'm poor as it is, so I. And what did you say to me earlier about the club? It's your, your favourite part of the club. Highlighting my Monday. It's what? The guitar is a highlight of my Monday. Coming to the club? Yes. Well, on the guitar, I, could, I didn't know how to strum properly. I didn't know any tunes or anything. I think it's really good, like, because you can, it's free, and there is, like, it would normally cost, like, £20 an hour for, like, guitar lessons, but I learn everything I need to hear for free, and it's great. Uh, I, I enjoy everything, but uh, most of it is uh, when the staff like you uh, are uh, really helpful. First of all, um, it's really big in the confidential, because usually, um, before I came here, I could really play in front of people, like I've all played in the little corner, but then I decided to do this and my confidence has grown and I can play more now. Uh, this uh, is a good uh, place to spend time and it's uh, helpful uh, with school as well, uh, because uh, we do music and I'm uh, planning to do my exam in third year, so I already do uh, uh, more than two instruments cool. at home. We put on some gigs. Uh, we might have to do like practice ones, like just in front of everyone first to get uh, like confident. Mm -hmm. Interesting. What are the staff like? Uh, very helpful. Like if uh, even if they don't know a song, they'll look it up, and then uh, they won't just help the person who looked it up. They'll also learn it themselves. So they have. So if other people uh, ask for it, they already know it. Are there any other musical activities that you'd like to see at the club? Uh, 
keyboard would be good and also uh, maybe the bagpipes as well. <laughs> The second project is provided by Lee McGrotty Fitness in Boghall Clinic. Young people receive personal training in a supervised setting and advice and support in health and well-being. Right, Kel, that's you at the end of your block of 13 sessions, so I just want to ask you a couple of quick questions. First one, just basically, if you feel any improvement with your fitness, if you feel any improvement with your general well-being and your health. Aye. You're getting a lot fitter. And what about things at school, like doing your PE and stuff like that, do you find that you're Aye, a bit fitter? 100% better. 100% better, good. And what about stuff like your diet and your drinking water and eating fruit and veg, are you making Aye. an effort with that? I am. Good, I'm good. trying my best. <laughs> Excellent. And what's your favourite bit about the training? Um, coming here and getting pushed. Getting pushed. And does a one to one help? Does that help your confidence? Uh, it helps with my confidence. And and, right. And would you have, would you have still felt as confident coming to the gym if it was in a group or there was maybe 10 or 12 years? Really or do you like are. getting the one to one? I like getting the one to one. Because you can speak to us a wee bit clearer about diet and exercise and problems and this and that. Aye. Good man, excellent. Um, next part of your programme, we're cutting you to, your, you're going down to your one session a week and you're going to be doing a homework programme in the house. So how do you feel about doing that? Are you happy with your technique? Do you know what to do? Do you know how to train safely? Um, I'm happy with the, like, the way I can do it myself and Good. how, how you have taught me. Right, so you're happy with your technique and Aye. your exercises. And that is something that you're going to commit to doing that once in the week mm -hmm. in the house? Yeah. Right, that. Both of these projects are making a significant difference to young people from West Lothian. Thank you to West Lothian Council for the continuing support and funding.